These are the no-name brand ones. Well, they had a brand, but they were, um, yeah, relatively unknown. I, I had never seen them before. It was literally a, um, almost a white packet box. There's no depth to the light. You can flick the high beams on, it does nothing. Well, it does nothing. It, it does something. Um, that it's like they don't have enough power to, to actually throw the light down the road. It's basically lit up right in front of the vehicle and that's pretty much it. There's not a hell of a lot of light coming out of it. This is another view of the um, cheap lights, no name lights. Like I said, the high beams. They do something because obviously the um, the headlight retractor thingy uh, opens up, but they just don't seem to have the power to penetrate um, any further down the road. So I'm about seven or eight meters away from that garage door. And you can see the amount of light that's being offered. So I'll repeat this same test with this same camera um, with fitting the new Osram Cool Blue Intense bulbs. And um, we'll be able to see the difference side by side. It's probably not a scientific test as you would replace one bulb. Um, say you'd replace that side bulb and leave this side with the you know the cheap bulb but um, unfortunately with these um, headlights in this vehicle in particular this um, 2010 Passat um, you actually have to replace you have to pull the whole front of the car apart nearly um, I've managed to find out to, to get get it to a way where you don't actually have to remove the headlights as such but um, or sorry, remove the headlights completely out of the car. You have to take the headlights and loosen them and um, yeah, there's a bit of a video on that um, on my channel as well, but it's not a small procedure, so I don't think I'll be attempting to, to just replace one, then go for a drive at night and redo this test. So um, this is probably the most side-by-side -side comparison that I'm gonna be able to do um, with this these cheap bulbs versus the Osram bulbs. These are the Osram Cool Blue Intense. You can see there is a huge difference. So, distance wise, easy, easy. Ah, oh, 100 meters down the road. Ridiculous! You can see the signs illuminating well and truly in the distance. So, it's chalk and cheese between the, the cheap light bulbs and these Osram bulbs. The video probably isn't showing it that well, but you can see those signs way over there in the distance. They're just... Yeah. The actual light output colour is a daylight colour. And it's just, yeah, it's just amazing. Just seriously, chalk and cheese. That's the same view. Looking at the workshop door. High beam, low beam.